Howdy doody, folks. How are y'all doing? This is Reese or Brush Yet Cub. It's a bit hot in my room and I'm wearing a long sleeve shirt. I don't know why that's important, but welcome back to another episode of our Texit Let's Play Adventure. And yes, I did almost say Texit. We are here with Alfred Feather Featherface and uh, we're going to go on an adventure in this episode. I've got all my adventuring gear, including, including I should say, a freezerite sword. I'm having trouble speaking as per usual, so go easy on me. We've also got a whole bunch of more arrows. I made some more and sharpened them up. Uh, all the basic tools that we need, so a torch, a crafting backpack, and a standard backpack, which has some food for me, some food for Alfred, and a chocopedia. But of course, before we leave, there's one thing we've got to do, and this is a baby adventure. I need to go ahead and preface, what are you doing in there? What on earth is going on here? I've never had a monster in here before. This is unacceptable. Gee golly. Ugh. All right, what am I doing? Right, loverly guy cell. One more time, we're going to try this before we head out. And as I was saying, we are going on a bit of a baby vacation. Our little baby trip. What just happened? What? What is... What? Oh! Wait, no. Did we just make a white... Oh, we made a white kid, didn't we? Oh, there's nothing more depressing than when you make a white kid and you're trying to make a black kid. Uh, this episode just went all kinds of weird on us. All right, well, that's still... I mean, that's not thats not bad. At least it's better than getting another yellow one, which is what's been going on. So I'm going to take it. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to take that and be happy with it. All those babies probably need to get out of there. I don't think they're going to grow up if they're in that bucket. Oh, well, not any concern of mine. None of this matters right now. None of this matters. What matters right now is our mini vacation. We're going to go to the pirate ship. We're going to storm the pirate ship. We're going to show the pirate ship who is the boss. We are the boss. Not Tony Danza. We are. And, uh, yeah, we're going to rock this. And the reason we're going to do this is we got to test our armor and our weapons and see if we're really capable of going out into the world and doing, like, a hardcore survival battle-esque thing. So let's get going! Ah, oh, wonderful. Yes, rain. Bring, bring on the rain. It will really set the mood for the battle that's about to take place upon the high seas. We're going on an adventure on the high seas as soon as I get over this mountain. Oh, wow. Okay, right. Focus. Need to get to the boat. How do I... I get there different, like, every time I go there. Every time I go there, though, I never really take damage trying to pass through, like, solid objects. Let's just stick to the beach. The beach seems like a safe way to travel to me. Oh, yeah, more feathers. Thanks, Alfred. Golly, there's a lot of feathers involved here. Okay, now, normally when we attack this boat, we have to deal with this little problem. Oh, gosh. All right, well, I didn't expect this. I didn't... I didn't... Oh, I didn't think about this. All right, so there's the boat, and there's the monsters. And what we need to do is we need to get aboard that boat without crashing. Hopefully, that's not good. That was not intentional. Hey, look, some gold. All right, well, we fell down here. And I'm telling you, this game's going to crash any second now. It's just... It's this inevitable thing that happens when I go near this pirate ship. I know it's going to happen again. So we might as well just go ahead and accept that that's, that's going to happen. First, let's man up and we'll give this a shot. We're going we're gonna to try to storm the boat. In the name of the almighty Alfred Featherface, I am here to destroy you. Where are the pirates? I think I've seen one pirate so far. Alfred, I'm getting down. Alfred, I am fighting a zombie. I don't know why... Oh. Okay, let's take out this guy. This guy is a pirate, and we will defeat him. He has a shield. His shield... Oh, he's the pirate boss. Wait. The pirate boss already? That seems a bit strange. All right, what's the best way to take this guy down? Oh, okay. We don't want to shoot at him. Yeah, that's not a good idea. Let's get this thing out and try that. Die! Die, you monstrosity! Die, you evil pirate boss of the seas. I knock you off of your boat. You drown. Um, I think he's going to come back at us. He's, he's still trying. Let's see if he can uh, swim and shoot at us. Let's see if that's a thing that he can do. No, no, he can't. He can't block while I'm shooting at him from... Oh. We also just lost both of those. All right, Alfred. Alfred, new plan. Calm down. Let's let's get the backpack out, Alfred. Alfred, no, get down. Stop. Okay, you're going to stay. I'm going to go down there and face this guy and try to get the arrows back at the same time. What is going on out there? That is just so strange. How did I get up here a second ago? Up here, like this. There we go. All right. 
And sword at the ready. Whoa. Where are my... Oh, there they are. Yes, got both of those back. Okay. Now let's take this guy out from beneath. Die, you monster. What just happened there? Um... I don't know what to believe right now. I don't know what to believe right now. This is confusing for me. So he can create ghosts of himself, apparently? Wait, no. Did I just kill him? What just happened? Oh my gosh! What is happening right now? Ah! Why is this a thing that keeps happening? There's a sword. There's a sword floating on the water, but it's not really him. No, it's really the pirate boss. It's really one of the pirate bosses. What is happening? What is going on? No, this is so strange and unacceptable. Oh, we're going to run out of... Oh, gosh. Okay, he snuck up on me. Oh, gosh. Oh, no, you don't. 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 I see you there. You are you are fooling no one, you multiplying monster of the high seas. You are not tricking me. This is not good. This is... Okay, we're doing good, though. We're doing good. How many feathers or arrows do we have left? Not a lot. Let's sink down here real fast and see if we can't collect some of them we've used already. I don't see any of them. I I don't see any of our feathers. There's one. Feathers. They're arrows. I don't know why I keep calling them feathers. Oh, gosh. We're going to drown. We are going to drown. We are going to die. We are going to die from drowning. This is not how I pictured this battle ending. I honestly thought that we would be killed by pirates. Not by drowning. Not by pirates either, Dad. But it. I'll build new arrows. I will defeat this pirate lord if it is the last thing that I do. And uh, I will never get any of my arrows back. But I'm okay with that now. Come on, you monstrosity. We'll just, we're gonna go fight with swords for now. I think, maybe. This is, this is a weird fight. This is a weird boss battle, I must admit. There's five of them now. I like how they're getting zombies involved in this now, too. Would we be better off going to land? I bet I could swim to land. Let's swim to the stalactite. We cannot get onto the stalactite. But we will still make our stand at the stalactite because it's it's an idea. It's a thing that we can do. I can't seem to hit more than a seven on these guys. What does the freeze ride sword hit? The freeze ride board sword only hits a six, so we don't want to use that. It's now getting dark. And this is still a fight that's happening. Um... Is my armor taking a lot of damage or something? Because I sound like I'm getting hit, but I'm not. It's very weird. People, I think we might have him. We might finally have him. Right here and now. This might be the end of this fight. This might be it. Oh, gosh! What just happened there? He's getting desperate now. Getting very desperate. Oh! One more hit ought to do it! We've done it! We've done it, Captain! We've defeated them! All of them, I think. I don't know. I picked up something. Yes! We got the ninja dagger. We've done it, people. We've gotten the ninja dagger. I want to go down and collect all this XP and maybe find some of my some of my arrows. That would be nice if I could find the arrows. <gasps> all right, so I actually have most of the arrows back now. I see that I'm only really missing two of them. Uh, I was probably only missing two of them this whole time. Hey, a uh, untamed chocobo. Awesome. That's always nice to have. But we actually have a tamed chocobo that we want to uh, focus on for the time being. And a pirate ship full of zombies. Um, jump! Oh, that hurt a little bit, but not too bad. Hey, Alfred, what have I missed? Just you dropping feathers. Okay. Oh, oh, I forgot to show you guys this. Check it out. I figured out what people meant by wearing the backpack. If you wear it, you can hit B and it opens it up. Ah, so, so useless actually. Because then you don't get to wear your armor. Not a good trade. I don't know where half of that stuff came from, but I, oh, I did find my other two arrows. Almost drowned in the process, so now you know. Let's, let's clear this place out of uh, zombies. Throw up some torches. Come on out, you monster. Yeah, you ain't got nothing. Oh, that's an interesting painting. All right, let's clear the deck first, and then we will worry about um, having a look around at all the treasure. Oh, okay. Creeper. Right. Looks like everybody's here for this battle. All right. 
Okay, apparently... Oh, yeah, that's right. Creepers destroy stuff on here. I'm used to Tech It. I have that turned off on Tech It. Um, how do I get in here now? I guess we can just... I mean, we've already started the process of vandalizing the boat. Is this the axe I brought with me? I thought I brought an enchanted axe with me. What? Or not an enchanted axe. I thought I brought, like, a tinker's axe. What happened to my tinker's construct axe? People? People? This isn't... This isn't... Mm, I don't know, people. I don't know. This isn't how things are supposed to be. I might just be confused. Alright, looks like we got... Loaded cannons? Alright, that's pretty awesome. This must be the brig. Not going in there. Some st oh, okay, that's where we store the TNT. That is good to know. And this is just a random hold. Which goes down here with more TNT. Wow. And, uh, and, and a skeleton. That's, that's always fun. See if he likes some of his own meds. Oh, he doesn't. He doesn't like it at all. Oh, this is, this is cool, guys. In fact, you know, this is so cool. Is this a, is this, is this a, is this a boat? This is a boat. It's not my boat, is it? Have I brought a boat over here before? Anyway, I was going to say, you know, we could probably move here. This would make one awesome house. Live in a boat with lots of TNT and cannons? Dude. I'm seriously considering this. You guys let me know what you think in the comments, because I will definitely move here. If you guys are like, yeah, Reese, that sounds awesome. Yeah, we'll do it. We will do it in a heartbeat. That would be cool. This has got to be where the captain chilled. Alright, I think I lit up pretty much everything I can. Let's start looting the chests now and see what we got. Oh my holy goodness. Okay, we've got a whole bunch of Eye of Ender, a music disc, some emeralds, go a golden feather, diamond, a, a water, water staff. What do you do with a golden feather? Uses. You can make some cloud boots. Okay, don't know what those do. Sounds cool, though. Iron leggings, a reinforced bow. Not as cool. Eye of Ender is cool, though. Uh, another one of these, another one of these. Okay, this is good. This is good stuff. Enchanted diamond helmet could be cool. Iron bow, mm, resources. See, the enchanted stuff, I'm not really that into. Because, oh, a life arrow? Don't know what that does. Fur cloth boots, stone shields. A golden apple? Really? Golden apples? That's awesome. Okay, how do I... What do I do with this thing? Block. Ah, so just by having it in my hot bar. I guess. Ah, I see. It, it has to charge back up now. Okay, well, that's that's actually really cool. Can I... No, okay. Well, that's, that's different. That's... I like that. Was that everything down here? I think that was everything. Life arrows. You guys need to get busy in the comments. Let me know what that means. I don't know what a life arrow is or what it does. Uh, if, if you see something really cool in here and you know what it does, I don't, most likely. Let me know. Just, uh, you know, you don't, don't be mean about it. I know, I know a lot of you guys just, just get a thrill out of being really rude whenever I don't know what something is and leave it behind. If you know what something is, just let me know. I'll go back for it. And it'll be, it'll be cool. What have we got in here? So here we got the basics. We got the torches and the arrows and the wheat. Doesn't look like really... Oh, melons. Uh, some gelatinous slime. Ice essence. Electric essence? I don't know what these things do. Uses. We can make an ice arrow or an ice grenade. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Magic essence, ice staff. I don't know what this stuff is, but it sounds really cool. Well, we're going to leave it here for now for safekeeping. Tin, I, okay, lots of ores. Lots of, uh, mm, backpack. Let's open up the backpack. We'll, we'll throw this, this treasures into the backpack. So all of our spoils from this trip will go into here. So all the, that's not so treasure. All the cool stuff that we don't actually know what it is, we'll throw in there. Can I sort a backpack? I can. Awesome. 
All right, so we'll grab all this stuff because it's, it's, it's basic and useful. Food, an oak shelf. Don't know what that does, but we're taking it with us. Along with some glowing bread because it's glowing for crying out loud. Uh, we might be coming back here, so I don't really need to take everything with me because if we do decide to live here, we're going to have to come back here. Oh man, I can I can see it. I can renovate this place out like you wouldn't believe. Maybe I could get control, you know, grab hold of the uh, the steering and take us out to sea a little bit. That'd be pretty cool. We could pretty much just sail around the world and see whatever we wanted to. That'd be awesome. That would be really awesome. All right, for now though, for now we return home. Yes, I hear you, pig. For now we return home with our spoils. And um, I will see you guys in the next episode. Gotta figure out a way off this boat now. Goodbye.